What's going on? It's squad. It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the airways, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Monday, May the 3rd, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the cycles, just checking out the channel, just checking out me in general, be sure to subscribe. Smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out. And remember, when you do hit the notification bell, Turn on all post notifications so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out when I put it out because sometimes you may get it like three days later or something like that. You want to get these videos as soon as possible so you can get on your hunting journey. <laughs> your treasure hunting or item hunting, your collecting, hunting, collecting journey. How about that? Uh, if you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, be sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that will be in the description box below. And there's a hashtag below the video as well. You spell it the same way. Um, first things first, Madam Nazar's location. Let's get to Matt. Well, Madam Nazar is over here in her Blue Water Marsh location. She will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know, or not of America. <clears throat> That's, uh, I mean, how I personally get to her when she's in this location. As I say each and every time, I'll simply ride from my moonshine shack, because that's where I mostly spawn. So I'll ride right down our location from there. Or I'll fast travel to Lagrasse or Lagras and um, run up to her location, which is kind of quicker, maybe. But I mean, it's up to you and your preference. I would just fast travel to Lagras and run up. Uh, the next thing I want to get to before we get to the cycles is the Caribbean rum bottle for today which is inside this shack. It's in Coulter. So make sure you use your uh, free fast travel while it's free for this week because we don't know what next week is. But it's right here inside the shack. As soon as you walk into the door, there's a cupboard. Grab it right out of there, I think. I think it's a cupboard or a shelf. Like a cabinet, maybe right next to the door right where my waypoint is grab that and while you're also up here if you want right in the next shack there's a eight of pentacles on the top of the table right here next to the that house there's also a bird egg up here somewhere like right about here let's see right here if you guys pay attention to the lines and stuff, where the creases are dark, where you get this dark, dark at right here, this is where the bird egg is. This bird egg is a hawk egg. If you guys want to come up here and get this while you're collecting, why not? I mean, it's free this week. You have no choice. I mean, you have a choice, but you have no reason to not want to collect if you're collecting. Let's go down here to where we normally do business. And I can tell you guys the cycles. The cycles for today, Monday, May 3rd, are Family Heirloom, Cycle 6, All Lost Jewelry, Cycle 2, Coin, Cycle 6, Arrowhead, Cycle 3. Wildflower cycle two, antique alcohol bottle cycle one, all tarot card cycle three, 
bird egg cycle one and fossil cycle five remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there the cycles the link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the twitter and instagram i have for the channel remember the twitter and instagram are mainly for madam nazar's location and any updates that i really have for the channel like um i do post this video on twitter after i make it so i share it there so you guys can get a quick link to the video if you don't get the notification but let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map uh starting up with the highest one which is between the m and a in marsh right here at this location if you guys pay attention to this little very faint line right here there's a little dash right there like right up under that dash that's where I will place the marker and right at this location you guys will get a random fossil right here at this location come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get there's also a couple things over here there's a cardinal flower about right here and right here at our next marker you guys will get a random coin I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get because it's randomized but come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get a random coin there's a couple tear cards down here I kind of don't want to bother you guys with it but I mean why not while you're collecting there's a tear card here and there's a tear card inside this house right here so go get both of those the first one is a two of swords and the one that's inside the shack or house is a seven of cups. Let's go over here to our next marker, which is inside this house, inside the chimney. Right here at this location, you guys will get a Durant Pearl bracelet. This Durant Pearl bracelet is a lost jewelry. So go get that. Also, while you're inside the house, there's a tear card, which is a eight of wands right here in this corner on side on top of a bookshelf. When this um, when this lost jury is right here inside the chimney, remember to check outside the house by the large tree. That's about right here at this location. It's maybe up a little bit like right here. I got to guess because it doesn't show on the map. <laughs> Right here at this location, come around this large tree and with your metal detector and you will get another lost jury. This one is randomized. I cannot tell you guys which one you will get, but come over here at this location and that's what you will get a dig for. Going to the left at our next marker, there's two things over here in this area actually. Right here at our marker, you guys will get a bird egg. This bird egg is a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's in a tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game uh, arrow. I was gonna say rifle. Um, and also, inside the shack or house, on the table, on the right, as soon as you walk in inside, there's a scotch whiskey, antique alcohol bottle right there at that location. Let's go over to the right a little bit to this mansion right here. And right at this location, you guys will get, right there, I try to zoom in super close for you guys. Right here, you guys will get a ebony hairbrush. This ebony hairbrush is on a bench right in front of the stairway. There's a stairway here and there's a stairway here. There's a bench here where my marker is and there's a bench here. Right on this bench, you guys will get a ebony hairbrush, which is a family heirloom. Let's move on to the next marker, which is right here at this location. Right here, you guys will get an antique alcohol bottle. This antique, this antique alcohol bottle is on the second level of this complex right here. So go to about right here. There's a little area where you can go down the alley there's a ladder 
go up the ladder, follow the path down, jump over the railing here, and follow that path across, then jump over the railing again, then follow the path down and around the corner to about right here, maybe up a little bit to like right there. But use your eagle eye. As soon as you get up here, you should be able to see the bottle uh, chilling in a, the crack of a, a door, like a doorway or whatever. Anywho, this antique alcohol bottle is a Irish whiskey bottle. If I did not say that, go and get that. Right here at our next marker is inside the saloon right here. This saloon, there's a door in the front. There's a door on the side. Either one you go through. Go to the back. Right here at this location, there's a shelf. On that shelf, you guys will get a Six of Wands tarot card if you want to collect tarot cards. Why not? <laughs> I keep saying why not. I feel like I don't want to say why not. Right here at this location, you guys, right across from Gus, there's a fountain in the middle. Can I see it? No, you cannot see it. Um, there's a fountain in the middle, but right at this location of my waypoint, there's a treasure chest. And right here on the ground, you will find a boxwood comb. Let's go over to our next item, which is like right here down this alley. Uh, follow the waypoint till you get to this alley right here. Go down a little bit and on the ground floor over to your left if you come from this direction here over to your left right there on the ground floor you guys will find a family heirloom which is a tortoiseshell comb. This tortoiseshell comb is sitting on a bench by the way. Uh, let's go over to our next marker, which is another family heirloom. This family heirloom is a carved wooden hairpin right here at this location. In a pile of trash, you guys will get a carved wooden hairpin, which is a family heirloom. You have to dig for this carved wooden hairpin. So come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get. Uh, at our next location, you guys will get right here. Let's zoom in. You guys will get a random coin. I cannot tell you guys exactly what coin you will get, but that's what's there. Down to our next marker, which is a or the cardinal flower that spawns over here in this area each and every day. In this area, whole area right here. Each and every day that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day. Let's go on to our next marker, which is a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you guys what arrowhead you will dig up. But right here, this is a dig spot. You do not need your metal detector, but come over here at this location. And that's what you will get, a random arrowhead. Remember, it's on the, the at the end, at the very end, of the cotton field that's right here. So come and get that. Um, and our last marker, which is right at the corner of the train station and roads. Right here at this location, you guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a rosewood hairbrush. This rosewood hairbrush is in a treasure chest right here at the very corner of the train station right before you get on top of that wooden platform right there there's a treasure chest right there so go get that there's a couple of tear cards inside of roads um i think it's one here it is one there i don't think uh there's one here right super close to the fence and there's one right through this little walkthrough area right there so go get all those there's also one up here by the way right inside this building this house so that's pretty much it that I have for you guys um, let me put this back 
in frame so you guys can see all the stuff or most of the stuff that I mentioned. The cycles for today once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 3, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Cards Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 1, and Fossils Cycle 5. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 6, Arrowhead Cycle 3, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Tarot Cards Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 1, and Fossil Cycle 5. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there written out for you guys. The Cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Which is Hitman Miyagi YT. Um, remember, if you do not know, I'm just telling you guys the cycles. The you have to put in a little bit of legwork and search on Google or YouTube for each cycle. So search Family Heirloom Cycle Six, and I'm sure a couple videos for Family Heirlooms cycle six will pop up as with each and every um, category or cycle or whatever but thank you guys for watching thank you guys for liking sharing commenting uh, and subscribing <laughs> I appreciate each and every one of you it is your main man hit man and remember to like share subscribe hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out. And remember, when you do hit the notification bell, turn on post notifications so you guys can get each and every video that I put out when I put it out. Uh, as I said, it's your main man, Hitman, once again. And I'm out.